Fair Work Australia has buckled to pressure and will now release its investigation into Craig Thompson's union within six weeks. The ACTU executive has suspended the health services union over corruption and misuse of members' funds. The health services union fought the suspension but went down 1,800 votes to 100. It is a very grave and serious step for the ACTU. Union whistleblower Cathy Jackson says the suspension is a stunt, leaving her union's corruption fighters out to dry. This is not a publicity stunt. This is a clear statement by, us, by the ACTU. There is zero tolerance for corruption. Fair Work's failure to provide a proper brief to Commonwealth prosecutors slammed today by a former head of the National Crime Authority as incompetence or a cover-up. I think this has saved Mr Thompson and the government uh, it's, it's hard to see how now this could turn into a criminal prosecution. But the opposition says fair work on its own admission has evidence. It should represent it properly. Otherwise, state police already investigating the union would be perfectly entitled to seek search warrants against Fair Work Australia. The HSU's acting president, Chris Brown, says the alleged corruption occurred five years ago when MP Craig Thompson was national secretary. The Prime Minister rejects suggestions that Fair Work Australia is flawed but says the organisation she created is under review and even refuses to give an opinion on whether its report should be released. All of these are questions for Fair Work Australia, it's independent of government. Late afternoon the Fair Work Australia chief told the Senate committee she will release the report within the next six weeks. Paul Bongiorno, 10 News.